book of notes that is just the Game & Watch matchup. And because for some characters, if you really struggle, that's sometimes what it takes in order to get over that hump to, uh, you know, make the difference and get that ground back. And while I don't think Ducks has such a book, it's clear to see that the uh, the time and effort against the Game & Watch has paid off, as now we're going to see if you can continue that kind of success. Right. Is that set lead still going to continue? Are we going to go 9 out of 10 games to favorite Duck? Um, most players, from what I can understand, top level on both sides, Game & Watch and Diddy Kong, believe this is a fairly even matchup. There's not too much uh, advantage one way or the other, which you know kind of explains I their back and forth. I believe so. I believe it's even. Yeah. Tell me why. They both got it. big. They both got big, fast hitboxes. Okay. They both have uh, like Diddy. Obviously, the the banana. You can't bucket a banana. You can revert. You can basically just have it come back at you. Right. But for the most part, nothing. Unless Duck is going to be playing Kazia. In that which was case, a very interesting little training yeah. mode button check. In, w in which case, things are things are quite a bit different. But um, the Diddy. The Diddy Game & Watch matchup is very, very even. We've seen uh, Meister, tw uh, Meister Tweak uh, wars, and I personally enjoy the matchup, like I said, because while Diddy Kong is light enough that you can get a lot of your uh, early cheese off on him with things like forward tilt and down tilt, uh, he's going to throw out just as many buttons as you are with things like Nair and, you know, all, all his crazy back airs and stuff. You know what his setups are going to be. You know what he's looking for, so you can plan accordingly to, you know, avoid banana and use it in your own favor. Yeah. Uh, and then even, and he has, his recovery is quite uh, predictable yep. in a lot of ways, especially like when he's floating out there in order for you, all you have to do is just hit it with meat and then he's out of, uh, he's out of the barrel blast. Mm. Out of the barrels. That makes plenty of sense. I can definitely understand, especially with uh, Diddy Kong's burst options and, uh, Game of Watch is like walling out options, and it can just be really difficult to find a single opening and then hold that opening, especially against Game of Watch. Yes, holding holding the opening is really the key of that sentence right. because Diddy Kong can still get openings, but how how far you can um, like hold them, mind you. I say this as somebody that has played Zenodo a couple times, and both times he has washed me, absolutely ran ran me out of the venue, kind of stuff. He uh, like that's that's Zenodo. That's like right. one, one, of the, one of the best players in the world. But you still believe it's a fairly even matchup, so yeah. I think that speaks for itself. When the players are of uh, even caliber, it right. is, yes. And I think that's what we're going to be seeing here. Yeah. With how these sets have gone back and forth with these players, how they played against each other so much, I, I believe actually, um, I need to check which one, but uh, Duck's second most played opponent of all time is Plus. Mm. But pl it's Plus is like ninth most played against opponent or tenth. So I'm not sure if that's going to work out in Duck's favor. I mean, so far it is, because look at that. Barrel's on the platform, hitting below it, and taking Plus's first stock. My goodness. Yeah, looking like Game Watch is down air. The and Plus, the high up, like throwing the banana straight down, still landing. Mm. We saw early in that, though. Duck was got plump up to like 102% before Duck could get much of, before Plump could get much of anything. Right. And then you're going to see down air off stage at that high percent. Yeah, they'll, they'll do it against Diddy Kong. My Pardon me, folks. Got a bit of a hiccups here. 45% on plus. Not a ton, but Duck has started a nice advantage state here. Actually just uses it to pull out banana, but then not picking it up. That's kind of a wasted advantage state. Back to neutral. Oh. What a ledge trap. Very yeah. interesting. How, how are you going to get around this? What do you do? It, just eat the peanut? No, obviously not. But yeah. He's looking for his banana. You don't have it. It's already on the stage. Combos, very nice. 37%. Oh, 53. Yep. That bomb hitting is big. Yep, monkey flip right in a bomb. Oh, but he picks up banana. Okay, air dodge. Go to yep, go to the ledge. Very safe option. Very nice. But banana into down tilt forward air. Still, look at this. 122 to 53. Duck. Look for any kind of. Oh, I expected to hit here. that down tilt, but actually didn't. So that's a little bit of a combo starter for plus, but. Oh man, Duck is actually having trouble getting back to stage. He gets walled out. Back All right. Takes it. Yeah, so. It's one of those cases where it was just kind of an overextension by Duck off stage. Like, not where you want to be. Big clap coming out from Duck there. Very happy to have traded that back immediately, like, especially yes. after how that stock turned around. 100%. And you see Plus looking like, I got to want to try and do the mental damage and finish early with that uh, with the nine, with the uh, the judge coming out. Getting a three, but not connected. By the way, three is my favorite number. It is the wackiest of the numbers. <laughs> it is both a shield breaker and a reverse hitbox. So if it lands, they appear behind you in right in down smash range. And nobody sees it coming. 
and then if they shield it, it's a, it's a shield breaker, so it might just pop it. That's very interesting. Ooh. Oh, Cher is punished, but slips on the banana, starts another one, monkey flip. 121-33, not out, not over just yet for Duck, but yeah, ah. that's brutal. Banana into up smash. Game one going for plus. Yeah, I think that up smash is supposed to catch a falling aerial option out of shield, but what it actually caught was Duck rolling after using that option. Mm. And instead of rolling away, rolling in, trying to catch, plus I guess doing something else like up being out of shield or something with a much shorter hitbox. Uh, in any case, it was a really good choice from Plus, and that's 1-0. Yeah, 1-0. Going back to PS2. Going to PS2? They, yeah, they didn't start PS2. Oh, yeah, going that back. was interesting. Okay, so we're going to PS2 now, allowing Duck a lot more space to run away, to reset neutral, uh, not get frame trapped, being able to uh, monkey flip kick high to recover to the opposite side of the stage. Mm -hmm. um, I don't think we're going to be seeing Duck do much peanut pop gun cancels, but you have a lot more room to do that, landing on the platform for safety. Yeah, uh, it's, this is where I typically will play this matchup. This is seen where, this is the gentleman for these two. It's like both of these uh, players, both these characters, I think really enjoy this stage, uh, especially when they're playing against each other. So we're seeing Duck already get started. Banana is now in uh, Plus's hands and they're just passing it back and forth. They're playing a bit of catch, they're playing a bit of catch. A little bit. How does uh, Oil Panic interact with Banana? Uh, you have no recoverable projectiles. Uh, it's just a reflector. So okay. if it's not energy-based, it doesn't go in, it just reflects back. And it counts as a hit? Uh, yeah. So the Banana, I mean, the Banana will still get one more hit afterwards. Yeah, okay. the, yeah so it's in, you're much better off just uh, trying to catch it. Right. Because even if it bucket hits and bucket land, like if the, revert, the reflect lands, uh, you're in end lag long enough to where you can't really get a pro proper punish. Right, or you can just shield it and then possibly pick it up right after it. Uh, exactly. It's shield. So exactly. that makes a lot of sense. Oh, trip. I can't believe that actually tripped. Expected to roll in. That was so patient for Plus to not do that. Okay. Look at that. Uh, rising Nair from ledge. Uh oh, be careful with the barrels. Duck knows how to control those. The downspout is almost actually connected, but we've reset a little bit here. In the corner is Duck oh. trying to get out. Not going to be able to get out today. Down smash, forward smash. That was even the sour spot of F smash. He was so close to him that uh, it was the stick that hit. Wow. Still took it off the side. For a split second, I was like, wait, is, that, is this actually going to do it? But no, he was at he was very much at high enough percent. Plus has the banana and is off stage to actually toss the banana to try to keep some safety, but Monkey Flip should take it. It yes. will. Two stocks apiece for these two, getting to game number two. Now, Very even looking a lot more in control as Duck this game. Yep, using barrels to try and see if he can get the damage onto plus if, at best, and at worst, you still get center stage. Gotta respect the shield. Cannot go for shield pressure as Diddy Kong unless you're doing down tilt further away. Oh, yeah, okay, yep. And then forward tilt. The rising bucket is like a little momentum thing. Just tossing the band back and forth, trying to find an errant opening. Something oh, to get him out of mutual, great, but Oh, but mash. great mash from Duck. Wouldn't have been the stock, but it would have been a chunk of damage. 84% next time you're grounded, that will be the stock. Yeah. It will. Oh. That's another thing, is uh, the angle at which you land bomb at, you can overshoot it at certain percents and get like a confirmed down air. And the confirmed spike down air, so ah. it forces into a tech situation. And they don't bounce. Short. Oh, plus tried to re the banana, I think. No. Oh. Oh, oh flips on the banana. Second try, though. Yeah, falls, yeah, falls out of S-Mash the first time. Tries it again after the banana. Still not enough to take it off the side. Okay. The banana confirm and down tilt confirm. Will give Duck the stock here, but you got to get back to stage. It's always so hard against Game to Watch. Monkey flip. I, not yet this time. But almost there, 122 to 139. Both these players doing a great job of holding on their stocks. For very long. Oh, instead of now, it's going to be Banana up smash on platform. Send plus. Final stock for game number two. Threw the Banana on the platform, expecting it to catch the landing, but it didn't actually. The up smash just shield poke, but Downer's going to trade the stock right back. This is as even as it gets. Yeah. Key takes it off the top. It's been, oh. That's, a, that's an inevitability, really. It's uh, eventually you will just be able to kill with Key. Right. When no, when nobody else got me, I know Key got me. Oh, that's gonna be not quite punishable. Plus, wasn't ready to run all the way over that direction. Yeah, it's gone. 
great spacing with the for the dash attack, but yep, now he's still getting hit by Monkey Flip. This is a, a very good opening for Duck. That was gorgeous. He's now making his percentage back. Oh, Reflect Banana still catches it. Hit, hits him in the air. Definitely. And now just a reset to neutral. I love that use of oil panic too. It's a good time to use it when you're about to get banana C dropped down air. It's the perfect time. Oh yeah. Especially because you can do like if you jump and pull, pull it out immediately, you'll still like rise up mm. with it. So uh, you can still just make sure you get back to ledge. Okay, oh barrel still connected, but he's on platform. See so many people hit rocket barrel boost through their opponent to recover and their opponent doesn't shield it and isn't ready for the punish. A little bit of circle camping. Both players just playing for space at this point. Neither one wants to overextend. Oh, Banana's still connecting though, but no follow-up from a duck. Going for hard reads instead of reactions. Hulf chasing him down with bomb. Looking for the meaty forward tilt at ledge. Not doing it. Yeah, Banana again. Monkey's gonna take kick back to the center of the stage. They're both dancing. A little bit of a scramble. Plus, trying to get back down to the ground. Fair is a great tool to do that. Banana's gone. Look, tucked, looking, still looking. Instead, there's rocket barrels. Look at that, just like that 4% difference between these two. Key is gonna land, 108, 1 to 90. The oh, trip still comes out. Oh, yeah, and still gets the pickup, but not enough to take it off the top. That's crazy. Plus, is able to get back down to the ground fairly effectively. Duck pulls out banana peel, just tossing it, trying to find it. Is desperate at this point to get a hit with it because it's so hard to find another kill confirm without going too aggressive. Oh, banana still has it back in hand, avoids it. Up B. You can watch banana, but it's. Oh, but watch for barrels. Oh my gosh. You hit him with the chair. Take a seat, sir. As plus goes up two to nothing. I'll be honest, I thought it was rocket barrels. This is what I've been talking about though. Rocket barrel boost through the opponent. There's, you know, a, a handful of ditties in the bracket today, and I've seen that go unpunished dozens it's of gotta times. It's gotta be an Indiana thing. Dozens it's gotta of be times an Indiana unpunished. thing. Even Plus was letting it go unpunished, and this time expected it, hit him with the chair on the way in. Now you're not gonna use it so errantly. No, no, you're gonna be a bit more pr pr uh, safe with it. Yep. Right, back to PS2. It's the right choice. Duck definitely made a lot more work on this stage happen. Plus, it happened very nicely. But this is not the opening uh, you're looking for is for Duck. Is get down throw immediately to 32%. Rapid jab, Banana falls just behind Plus, so not gonna get tripped up and eat that whole Rapid jab. Banana still in hand as he drops it. But gone, re-picked up. Oh, how good air dodge Banana, but that lands him right in the area for that up B conversion. Goes up, must come down, but not that banana is. Oh, Whoa, wow! Nice. Any other character you might be dead. Oh, absolutely. But low enough percent that Game Watch will make that back. Yeah. A little bit more damage there, we definitely would have killed, but now it's Ducks. So once again, gotta find their way back to stage and then find an opening. It's just a two part series where Plus is just making it very difficult to watch. Oh, yeah, and still off stage with the key. Plus taking first stock again for game in game three. Okay, wow, looking for a banana fall up into forward tilt to get him off stage. Didn't have the uh, the kill power yet to get it confirmed. So good good, good thinking for these extensions, my goodness. Yeah, I agree. I'm trying to just toss banana out because Plus is not going to just recover lazily, like up B to the ledge and get caught by a banana drop into down air. No. He's going to recover high every time. And there's not a lot of ways for Duck to actually punish that. Yeah, there's, that's one of the saving graces, I guess, in this matchup for Game Watch is that Diddy doesn't have one of the best, although the landing, the banana landing on shield was just enough to shield poke to ah. give him space to land the up smash. How did he just drop shield? No, that was really great then. Okay. Banana, still making it back. damage were even up. Aggressive recovery with bomb, good pivot grab. Oh, but just a little bit missed time. Gives a uh, oh, duck man. great opportunity for that monkey flip. Got a shield here. Snuffing out, out all these show. approaches. Watch out for barrels. That's so nice. The barrels have been heat seeking missiles today. Plus is playing on the platform, not afraid. The key does shark through in the opposite direction. Looking for the down smash. No way. Rocket Barrel Boost comes back and saves his ass. Again? Yeah, <laughs> you just going for up smash? Oh, yeah, there's up smash. It. Yeah, okay. finds it. So now Duck, one stock lead here. 125 to a fresh stock on plus. 
gets up, hard mash out of that grab. <laughs> Plus, he's really not afraid to play on top of these platforms, but I'm wondering if now he should start he should be afraid. He should start to be fishing for some sort of kill option at this point. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, there's only so much you can do as Game Watch in this case. This is where Game Watches can actually kind of struggle to kill in a lot of cases. Unless, you know, you got chair. Chair is really the saving grace there. Yeah, it the it can become very easy to just start fishing for things like chair and down tilt. So good job from uh, Plus to land that yeah, one. Yeah, very nice. Oh, it's going to start a little bit of a combo here. Don't DI in! What are you doing? It's, sc it's scary DIing de de out. You gotta do it, though. You can't get these Nair combos. You just lost your entire percentage lead. Oh Monkey Bush is gonna even it up a bit. But stage pressure still totally feels like Plus has got the hand. Dead even. So now we just Plus going back to his home up on those platforms. My good, these two are just looking for that next big thing. Yeah. I don't know. I don't think we should be fishing for down smash here. Plus here, it's not going to kill with this percentage. Uh, now it will though. It might be a good thing to fish for on landings. You can see when Plus has the stage, so many frame traps. But when they don't, they're playing very erratically up top on the platforms in the air. Oh, but banana F smash will take out the side. So duck getting a game here. Going two to one. Massive. That's big, but now plus gets stage counterpick, and I find uh, I find it to be hard pressed to go be go back to PS2. I mean, I don't think that there's a chance, right? Like, don't run it back. Yeah, we just go small battlefield. Yep, makes way more sense. You give Duck a simple. lot less room to recover. You're similar to like how we were talking about Snake. You're walling out your vertical walling is going to take up a lot more percentage of the stage, make it a lot more difficult for Duck to recover high or low. Uh, you can corner pressure pretty much 100% of the time now because the stage is way smaller. It's a better stage. Mm -hmm. Better stage, exactly what Plus is looking for here. And already off the start, Ducks, just gonna, re gonna get the resources going. Oh my gosh, Duck nice. found, the, found a bit of an opening, 32% in a blink of an eye. But Game wants to do that, just do that right back to you. Most of these characters get combo extensions off the platforms a lot more easily because of how close the platforms are together. And we could see that come into play a little bit more, I think, on Duck's side than on Plus's side. Duck has been not getting comboed right underneath the platforms, and it's been DIing away from the platforms for the most part. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. See it. Unblockable. Did you see that recover to center stage? Yeah, Monkey, <laughs> monkey Flip does do that. Yeah. It do be doing that. It does go through uh, meat a lot. On the ground, banana in hand, banana in the air. Can't land, can't do much of anything. Oh, there's <laughs> go, there goes nine. No. He's, it's okay. He, now he knows it works. Yeah. He knows it's there. It had to be tested. Oh, okay, very nice. Oh, dash back F smash to land. So, duck from winning game three to now having a one stock lead in game four. This is huge. Yeah, Duck is starting to feel like he's a little bit in Plus's head. Plus has to start, like you were talking about earlier, use more erratic options. Use the entire kit of Game & Watch, and that's a great choice. Up smash is fairly safe. Go for it until right afterwards to get staged. And if it hits on shield, it pushes your opponent away just enough to, uh, and a lot of times, make it down smash land as soon uh, as they twitch. I thought that was going to be a down air for sure. Gets falling there and back air. Still has him out off stage. Up there is not going to do enough to take out the top. Harry oh. monkey flip, but oh, you got to know he goes through you. Plus, really wants to find something. Is patient Bob enough to not it. go too crazy, but might need to be a little bit more impatient. There's another monkey flip lands 53 to 146. Now you're starting looking at a Diddy with rage. Yeah, Duck is running around, just dancing on the Being very, very slippery. Like a banana peel. Knock this. Oh, and reads the roll into the aggressive roll in from Plus. Yeah, that was a very gorgeous choice right there. Down jab tilt is so strong. Jab one down tilt. Game one just jab one mix ups. It's crazy. I love it. But here you go. Electric slide again. And that's going to do it off the side. So Duck, one stock away from forcing a game five when it looked like this was going to be a 3 0 for Plus. And plus, once again, playing on these platforms. I mean, you're all over the stage. You've got so much movement available to you, but it just feels like Duck is catching you every time that you come close. Yeah, it's, these openings, it's like kind of left the ringer here. But now, as we say that, finally, Game Watch combo's coming out. Good parry. Charges up, up, up smash. Almost ringing off the top. That was big, and that was a banana combo confirm as well from Plus. Great awareness. 
This is way closer than it was just 30 seconds ago. Falling there. Yep, looking for that next. Anything you can get. Maybe another unblockable. But sir, I don't think the unblockable will kill. That's the name of just drops it beneath. Oh, another monkey flip. 68, 97. People are doing so much work here. Again, F smash not landing. Instead, he goes back to get banana. That leaves him wide open for that dash attack. Watch out for barrels, again. I think Duck just wants the barrels to be sniped out so they can start using them as a projectile at this point. Oh my gosh, possibly. Especially on these horizontal stages. Oh my gosh, had the banana confirmed. Looking for these dash back, but just playing patient. But ah, oh, there it is. Down tilt up smash. 114 to a fresh stock here. Plus needs something big. Duck needs to just keep up the game plan here. Yeah, Duck is fishing for a banana confirm at this point. Plus, is playing very, very patiently, not going too aggressive, but choosing a great opening really wanted something fancy there. Not gonna get it. I don't, yeah, I don't think he let uh, nine, or I don't think he let Judge rip since that nine, so now he has it loaded up again. With banana gun. And it's off stage, it should be reset by now. Oh, reversal. Oh, oh. But, he, but he whiffed, missed it. Unblockable, it's gonna Big be opening. damage. But needed to get more. Yeah, 37% is not enough. Now you have to find two more openings before a kill confirm. Oh, but, but now I we're starting to see Duck rip these up smashes. If Duck keeps fishing like this, Plus might be able to find a way back in. Now Plus has banana in hand. You never know what will happen. Ooh. They're both fishing a little bit, but it's way safer for Plus to be fishing with some of these safe smash attacks. Oh, catches Banana with dash attack. What goes up? Must come down instead. He's not going to be able to re-grab it. It's a lot of shield pressure, though. Monkey flip. What a spot dodge. Just outspaced the down smash. Both of these guys are dancing. A down smash into F smash will kill at this Oh, my point. gosh. There it is. Oh, my F goodness. Smash. Is this enough to take off the side? It is. And just like that. Plus takes it three to one over Duck, hanging on with 147 on his last stock. He brings it back to put Duck away and move on to win losers finals. And the rage made all the difference there. Without